What's up guys and welcome to Doodle Kingdom. This is a brand new Doodle God game that just released on Steam. It's been available on mobile for a little while, but you guys loved it when we played Doodle God on the Steam version when it released last year. It's actually one of my most popular videos of last year. So I thought, well, Doodle Kingdom's coming out. Might as well play that too now. Once again, I actually haven't played this game before, but if you want to see more and if you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section below. But with that being said, let's doodle up some kingdoms or whatever we do in this game. Brave New World. In the beginning, God created. The, no, wait, I'm not done. Then God made water and volcanoes. Then he had sufficiently poor judgment to create people. And people started developing new technology. So fancy. This goes by really fast. It only took them a few centuries to mess with something. Then that's when God decided to start all over again and create a beautiful world full of magic and sorcery. Magic, and it was called Lord of the Rings or, or something. Okay, that was incredibly fast. I don't understand why there's two. Is this like, does it think I'm playing like two player or something? What is going on? All right, Um. so I guess I'm playing a controller right now. So it's super duper weird, but okay. So basically it's Doodle Kingdom or Doodle God in the way that you get to combine stuff. So let's do Flatlands and Mountains. Nope, let's try uh, Sky and Mountains. And that will make, in a row. all right then, a flying island. There is an art or rather a knack to flying. The knack lies in learning how to throw yourself at the ground and mess. So with Doodle God, it was about learning how to make the world. But here it's about making like a fantasy kingdom world. So what do we get here? Um, crystals are used to purchase hints, frames, etc. Okay then, so I guess it's customizable stuff. So we could go like here, new element created. So now we have flying island. We could go over here and we could do life and magic, or life and life, life and magic, life and flying island. Huh, interesting. So there's totally new stuff though, as you can see. So like maybe we could do sky and then sea. Nope, mountains and sea. There you go, let's go to make a iceberg. The mind is like an iceberg. It floats with one seventh of its poke above water. Oh, <laughs> never heard of that one before. Um, let's see what's in the water here. Now we have the sea and the iceberg. Hmm. Oi, I'm watching you. What? Excuse me? Why are you? Okay, now I'm scared. Now I'm being watched. So interesting. <laughs> so this really is a lot like the first game. Oh, there we go. Lands and flatlands makes beast, forest, and humans. We got like a combo going on there. The dog is the only animal seen his that has seen his god. Aw, that's sort of cute, I guess, because man's best friend. But either way, it seems beast, forest, and humans. So that's gonna add for a lot of stuff going on here. Yeah, okay then. So this is our first like expansion into whatever this is, which I guess is like sort of the human corner. And then we have animals or some kind of forestry. So we could do, what, if, what happens if we combine beast and man, we get werewolf? Nope, we get a domestic animal. That makes more sense. <laughs> Nope, that's not gonna work. Sky and human, flying humans. Oh, here we go, flatlander humans. We'll make a peasant. I mean, that that's sort of assumptuous. All right then, so what happens if we give a peasant life? Or give him magic? Well, humans and magic will make a wizard, right? A magician, new element created. <laughs> All right, cool. Uh, now we got something, oh, I guess like mythological creatures. So can we get a double magician? Let's try a magician with like, well, I mean, magic is obvious. Flying island, life. Oh, here we go. It's gonna be summon. All right then, so I'm guessing he can like summon different beasts and stuff. This is very interesting, this is a lot different. So we could summon a human, no, a peasant. <laughs> peasant monster, arise. Um, let's try, hmm, probably something like an iceberg or a sea. Um, hmm, I can't summon a magician, that'd be awkward. Um, huh, what could I use summon for? This is very weird, How like a rock monster. Yeah, and I'm trying, and it's difficult. <laughs> Cut me some slack. Ooh, a oh, a field, oh, okay. Plow deep while sluggard sleep. Well, okay, sure. <laughs> so now we got a field. Now, what if we combine that with a domestic animal? Um, Where is the cow at? Oh, geez, I'm losing it all, guys, I'm losing it all. All right, then, boom, nothing, really? Oh, this makes something, oh. Come on, how many times can you make domestic animal? Ooh, what is this? A triton, I was thinking I was gonna make a fisherman. Uh, I have no idea what a triton is. I guess it's like a sea monster. Um, so why don't we combine that with maybe like a summon? Like, let's see. Nope, what am I waiting for? I'm not waiting for anything, I'm the one working here. 
All right, so this is very interesting because I'm not really sure what that could be used for. Oh, oh, wait. Human plus mountain equals, I guess because they're get foraging it, I guess. Character is a diamond that scratches every other stone. That's rude. <laughs> uh, so now we have a stone, which should be in here, no. Let's see, where would stone be? I guess in here. I guess it's sort of curated items. So what happens if we try to summon a stone? Okay, okay, okay. Um, a stone beast, a stone domestic, a stone field, flatlands, no. Stone sky, stones are out of the sky might be a little awkward. Oh, here we go. Boom, a troll. Very cool. <laughs> and not the internet kind, but now we got beasts, like monsters. So what happens if we combine a troll and a human or a peasant, nothing? Uh, hmm. A beast and a troll, mountain, sky. I know, I know, I'm just trying different stuff though. Uh, hmm. Use a, no, I'm not using a hint. <laughs> so can we summon a troll? We cannot. Interesting. All right, so we got fish. And fortunately, it was interrupted by the fact that they wanted me to rate the game, even though we're not playing on something where you can rate it. I guess, <laughs> that was weird. But okay then, so we got fish. So what happens if we can find, combine like fish with like beast? Nothing, domestic animal. Then what happens if we combine it with human? I'm guessing we're gonna get another triton? Let's find oh, out. No, mermaid. Okay then. Um, hmm. Now with the mermaid, <laughs> I don't know. Have it hang out with a troll. Interesting. I'm not really sure what we could do with the mermaid. All right then. So there is actually a few more things we can see in the main menu here. We've been in Genesis, which is just like Doodle God, but there's also quest, which is return. Like there's different quests you can do. I'm not really sure how we do them, but there's also my hero. Tap here to send your hero on his way. Um. Okay. Oh my. Um. Tap here to make your. Okay. I'm using keyboard. I can't. I'm not keyboard, but mouse. So I don't know. No, not mouse. Gamepad. <laughs> um. Buy better equipment for your hero. Okay. So I can. I guess with everything that we've done, we can buy stuff, but I, I can't afford anything right now, so. <laughs> interesting. Um, but this one costs gems. So this is very interesting. It looks like we can actually level up our hero a little bit, and then we can do stuff with that. Ow, I ran into a monster, and we won! All right, so we can heal our hero. Um, sure. All right, you can buy potions that will restore your hero's health and energy. I don't need that right now, but oh, look at that, a chest plus 10 coins. So this is like a whole different thing. It's sort of confusing, but that doesn't mean it's bad. It's like, it's just weird to sort of figure it out. I do have a chest apparently that I can open somehow. Um, okay, nope, it just, I, I am so confused. All right, so we opened another chest there. Oh, I guess if we're running past a chest, we can open it. Ah, I see. So we can just sit here and pay attention and we get some more stuff. Okay, cool. So we can go ahead and pick that up and then I can make him charge a little more, I guess. I really don't know what that'll help with. Oh, okay, he's healing up. Cool. <laughs> this is really odd. All right, so we're about to get our first level up here. Opening up more chests along the way as well. So say boom, get that, get that, get that. And boom, we're level two. So maybe we can stop for a second and then my hero, nope, I'm just fighting this thing still. Um, okay, here we go, here we go. So I can go ahead here and maybe upgrade some stuff. It's very weird, it can work on controller, just doesn't really want to. Let's go ahead and get two more points into fighting, then we can get up here and we can maybe buy a new sword. So let's go ahead, whoa, whoa, whoa. there are a lot of stuff here, but you can see this is like a lot of stuff, okay. Let's go ahead and, I don't have enough money for this though. Everything is so expensive. Um, and I can't buy, I would need to be level three for that. So there still is not too much we can really buy for right now. But all right, no taken. So it looks like there's sort of two games in one here. This is like one mini game that we have, of course, that we can, you know, try out and play and do all this kind of stuff. But we can also go and keep on making matches, earn up more gems, that way we can maybe unlock new things for this guy. So there's sort of two games in one here, which is really interesting. This is a different game, I can say that much. It's definitely new compared to Doodle God. Doodle God was pretty darn simple, but Doodle Kingdom's a little bit more interesting, a little bit more complex. Pretty fun though. I hope you guys enjoyed a little video on it. Let me know what you think about Doodle Kingdom in the comment section below. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to give it a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point of video, make sure you comment Kingdom Zebra so I know you've watched it in the video and that you're a zebra task if you are. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.